So yesterday we brought it in here. Um, John took out the mirror because I'm going to put in like a chalkboard so that I can change it with the seasons and just all that fun stuff. So this is going to be a chalkboard. Um, I'm going to paint it all white and then we are going to, we filled in all of the, what's, what's the word? Um, handle? Right? Not knobs. Is it a knob? I don't know. Um, we filled in all those, we filled in all those holes anyways. You can see it had a ridiculous amount of handles. Um, we aren't putting that many back in. I just, it was excessive and not that pretty. Um, so we filled all those in. I'm going to clean it. And then later I'm going to put on the first coat of primer. And then I'm, I can't decide if I want to keep this little thing. There's one there on the front and then one up here on the top. John's not sure about them either. Um, I do want it to look old, but I'm not sure. So I'm gonna put on the first coat of primer. It'll be white, so the primer will tell me if I wanna keep them or not. If I don't wanna keep them, John's gonna help me fill them in. Um, so yeah, I'm excited about getting this going. It's something I've been wanting to do for a while and we've just not had the time to get it in here. So we finally got it last night. So my first step is going to be to clean it really well because it is messy um, we had it in the back room right where close to where John has been sanding because it's right there that's where he's currently working at um, hold on. yeah that's where he's currently working at right now on the house that is the little hallway that we built in that leads into the pantry and then his room um, so yeah that's where he's been working and see if you can tell by the floor it's just it's it's still dusty back there because he just sanded just a few days ago. Anyways, I'm rambling. Um, yeah, it's dirty. I'm going to clean it really good and then let it dry. And then after um, John leaves for lunch, I'm going to put on the first coat of primer. And I am very excited. And yes, I'm wearing my pajamas. Way I see it, if we're not going anywhere, why dirty up more clothes? And I'm just wiping it off, dusting it with this Mrs. Meyer rose scent because I love it. it Okay, so there she is, all cleaned up. Gonna let it dry, and then later, um, probably after John comes home for lunch, I will put on the primer.
Okay guys, so John put a, another coat of mud over the screw holes last night when he got home. Um, today I'm going to do another coat of primer and then we will be moving on to paint. Um, yesterday I started at the bottom. I learned a lesson. You don't start at the bottom. You start at the top. I had to keep leaning over the drawers because they had to be open. So today I'm going to start at the top and yeah, make it easier on myself. So let's get it done.
beautiful. Now it's not perfect. If I wanted perfect, I would have um, went and bought one at the store. But, so this is from 1996. And yeah, it's beautiful. I love it so much. Um, it does have, like I said, a little imperfections here. One of the um, screws from the chalkboard came through. We just fixed it. Um, John could have took more time to fix it better. I told him to leave it. I am ready to use it. I don't care. So um, I told him to leave that. And then we put two, um, just he installed two extension cords into it and then hooked them all together. It's all on one circuit or one cord, whatever. And so I am very excited, guys, to get this put together. I'll probably go ahead and decorate it after it dries. Um, I'm gonna put white contact paper down here. I don't have none currently. Where the coffee pot will be sitting, we'll have a piece of white contact paper. So yeah, very excited. Now I'm gonna let it dry and then decorate it. And I'll probably show you again so I'm so excited about this. I love how it came together and yeah, 